Hey guys, it's Stan from Project Mojo here, and I'm here with Tex HD or J. And uh, we're literally going to be talking about uh, a few of the upcoming films that we've got uh, for 2016, or pretty much for the rest of the year um, that we're gonna that we can reveal to you now without spoiling too much. Um, so Jay has been in my videos. I'll be a picture of him on screen now. Just you'll recognise him if you watch some of my other videos. And um, so yeah, he's just with me today to kind of talk to you about what we're gonna do really. Um, so film-wise, we've got uh, quite a few horror films coming up and a few action films. Uh, one film that's gonna be the next one that's coming up is another short horror film called Into the Woods. Now uh, this is set in 1999, and uh, wait, it shouldn't. We can't really tell tell them much, can we, Jay? No, because that would spoil it. But, um, can tell you <coughs> just the basics. Well, so, um, yeah, you can yeah, if you want. It's, it's, yeah. Should I say? Yeah, yeah, go on. Yeah. So, um, yeah, it's going to be a 30 minute long horror thriller movie that will have the typical killer but with a slight twist of our own yeah 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 because uh, kind of a lot of the ideas from this have come from Jeepers Creepers and other classic horror films like Friday the 13th um, and there is a bit of a change in this because um, we've got Jackson who is one of us who hasn't been in a had a main role really before so he's taken up he's kind of stepping up into the spotlight um, for Into the Woods and also Jay is directing it so yeah. Wait, what are you, so Jay, what are you gonna, what are you like willing to do as a director that, because I've directed every other film that we've done and kind of we're giving other people a chance now um, to do something. Uh, so Jay, what are you gonna really do as a director? Um, try not to let the others like piss everyone off. Because <laughs> that was a big problem, wasn't it? Because. Yeah, well. Like, <laughs> Yeah, we only had one camera battery because I lost one, and uh, it kind of, kind of made filming a lot more stress. So we had to get stuff done, and then we have to run back to the house and charge the camera, and then come back out. And now I found my other camera battery, so it's going to be a lot more chilled back now. Mm. Like more recording time as well. Yeah, more recording time. Um, we've also got more like, uh, more experience with um camera men now. Yeah, 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 we, ha we have, cameraman. yeah, we have got actual set cameramen now, off into the woods anyway. And then for other episodes, we'll have people who aren't going to act and have set cameramen. Because one thing is having everyone acting, because uh, we kind of dumped everyone on playing a zombie in County School. People then began to get confused and stuff. So it makes a lot more sense now that we have set cameramen and set actors. Yeah, um, but do you think camera skills have improved a lot? Uh, yeah, by far. Like, there's not a lot of shaking anymore. Yeah. And I mean, in episode one, like in the first ever episode of County School, the originals, um, the camera angles were pretty awful. Like, it would stay at one angle for four or five minutes of just talking. People would accidentally walk off shot. And yeah, you, you, you kind of witnessed that. Go, go back and look at episode one and you'll understand if you've got the time. Um, but one thing that I could definitely say has improved, and I think a lot of you can as well, is our editing skills. Now, editing team... Um, um, well, we're putting together a team at the moment, but since the start of the YouTube channel, it's literally just been me who's edited um, most of the videos. Jay has just picked a few things, kind of. We've all chipped in a little bit, but it's been mostly me. So we're going to get a set editing team now, um, hopefully for Into the Woods. Well, we, we want to do that, don't we, Jay? Yeah. We need yeah. some, like, yeah, the experienced people. We need to train them to use ABS, because that's the editing thing we use. But, um,. Which is pretty good. Mm. But, um. Well, I've used ABS all the way through since the first ever episodes that we, or the first videos we even did, or I even did on my old channel and stuff, uh, which I'm not going to leave a link to, because some people probably already know. And if not, it's very embarrassing. I did have some, uh, Nerf videos which I properly <laughs> edited, which were not. <laughs> not very nice. Um. <coughs> <laughs> but uh, so yeah, we stuck with AVS all the way through. It's a decent editing software. You can look it up. I think it costs around two hundred dollars. Uh, so in pounds, I don't know, uh, one hundred and seventy-three pounds, like something like that, along the lines of that. Uh, you can check it out, guys. It comes with a lot of other stuff in a package, like AVS file converter, AVS screen recorder, AVS whatever. It comes with all the shazam. So yeah, you can pretty much do a lot of stuff with that. Um, so yeah. 
we don't really want to spoil too much about Into the Woods, do we? All, well, all we want to say is that we are hoping for it to be like at the, the next step up with the film and editing, aren't we? Hmm. Yeah. Uh, well, yeah, is that it? Or is there any more? Well, I don't know if we want to really say much about more Into the Woods, but it's going to be new and innovative to the channel. It's going to be a lot better editing, a lot better filming, and we're going to try and step the acting up a notch as well, right? Because we yeah. have been criticised for the acting a little bit by um, yeah. Hayes. Well, we might want to get rid of people like um, Joe. Um, <laughs> but, um, yeah, because that not dead yet in the bloopers. <laughs> that, was, that was pretty bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyway, we'll leave it at that. Um, we'll go on to our next film, which is another horror film. We'll get on to the action thriller ones in a bit, guys. Um, which is Spooks. Now, I haven't really told anyone uh, much about this. I've planned it with Jackson. Um, no, who's on I screen haven't now. even heard about this. Yeah. I've planned it with Jackson. We've kind of been planning the storyline for it a bit, or not really. We're having ideas, like adding up ideas and stuff, building on to the storyline. Oh, by the way, can I just add that the script for Into the Woods is pretty much done anyway. Um, so we've been building up onto the storyline of Spooks. Now, I can tell you a bit about Spooks, so I want to tell you a bit, because it's not going to be out for a while, and I think you guys want to know about it. So basically, it's taking on from Scream, uh, like a classic horror film. I heard, I know, well, I know a lot of you have heard about it. Maybe a few of you might have watched it. It's a really good film. You should go check it out. Um, so that's a classic horror film with the classic as ax uh, aspects of a horror film. So it's got like the slasher in it. It's got the nerd. It's got the hot one. It's got the dumb one. It's got the strong one. It's got these are all the characters, by the way. It's got all those kind of iconic, traditional kind of characters that you would expect to see in a horror film that get picked off one by one by the killer but Spooks is going to be our take on Scream. Now Scream was filmed in 1995 and set in 19... it was filmed in 1999 or 2001, I don't know, it was set in 1999 I think so in Spooks for us will be set in 2016 so it's a modern day Scream pretty much and one thing I do want to add to it is the killer in Spooks, now Jay does know about the killer what he is a signature costume. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> I actually don't. Oh, you don't? No. Oh, I thought I might have showed yes. you. Hang on. I will. I'll show you. I'll show you in a minute. Um, but okay. well, there'll be a picture of him on screen now. Uh, he is like, so you know the little kids' ghost costumes where they cut two eye holes in it. Um, oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's gonna be like that. Yeah, the li like the little bed sheet with the two eyes, and that's what the killer's gonna wear, and it is gonna be a sick film. And if Spooks, we aren't going to do this with Into the Woods, but if Spooks does get, if it does well, then um, we will probably make a season out of it, or a few seasons, which will be pretty cool. Um, so if you guys do like it, comment, um, well, after we've made it, obviously, because you haven't seen it yet, um, uh, if you want to see it made into a season, because I think we'd be able to do that, right, Jay? Yeah, but it would be quite nice as a season, but I think we'd, like, only make one. Cause yeah, yeah, right. I agree. But um, I think on the channel, we need more standalone films rather than seasons of stuff, because if you look, we haven't done many, like, single films on their own, have we, Joe? No. Um, yeah, and I, can't, I mean, some of us do specialise in that. Obviously, some of us specialise in seasons, through carrying through storyline and stuff. But yeah, so Spooks will be nice. Now, the next film is an action film um, that I made about two years ago, um, and it was one of my biggest hitting films uh, called Teenage Warfare. I don't know if you... Have you heard of it, Jay? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I've watched a few bits of it. But... Yeah, it was, it was really old. Um, so, basically, we had to take it down for some reason, which I'm not going to go into now. Uh, but it was pretty much my best film I've ever made. I, I, I loved it, and it's gone out as a classic. Everyone, everyone will remember Teenage Warfare. It's been following me for a while. It was sick. Now, it's about teenagers that uh, are put into an experiment, almost like the Hunger Games, and are dumped into a forest to see if they can survive and the last man standing wins. And this is all as a test that they find out, and they're all being uh, studied. And then, after the teenagers fighting, there's a lot of action in them fighting, they begin to realise, oh, we have to work together. Um, to find a way out of this place, and then they eventually realise they're in a dome simulation. They break out, and then they're in the labs, and then it's 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 going to be a sweet ass action film. It's going to have some really innovative stuff because we're hoping to work on this 
um, towards the end of August, uh, early September, so pretty much near 2017, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, so, so they are the three main big films, right? Yeah. But, um... <clears throat> oh, God. Sorry. Um, <laughs> oh. But, yeah. Yeah, obviously we'll have and some it's... more, like, smaller videos, won't we? Um, yeah, in between yeah. these larger films. Like, do you reckon we'll do any more gaming videos on this channel? Um... I don't really think so, because, like... Well, we could make another channel, like, Mojo Gaming, Project Mojo Gaming or something. I know. Actually, alright, guys. Comment down below if you want a Mojo Gaming channel and or a Mojo Airsoft channel for recording Airsoft videos. Uh, I think they'd be quite cool, right? Because we've wanted to do Airsoft videos for ages, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Um, um, so I think um, that'd be quite cool. So comment down below if you'd like these channels, or I personally would prefer to keep it all on one big channel. So yeah, comment down below and um, go and subscribe to Jay's channel, uh, Tex HD. He'll, link will be in the description. At the moment, he's doing Destiny videos. He's had a few big hits with like over a thousand views and stuff, haven't you, Jay? Yeah. Yes. Was, like, they were like XP videos and things, but. Um, yeah, so he's doing Destiny at the moment, I'll probably do some other gaming videos, maybe some other, like, IRL videos, so, uh, so yeah, go and check out his channel, I'll leave the link in the description for you guys to go to, and I guess we'll see you in Into the Woods, which we're recording this Saturday, and I'll hopefully get edited, um, oh, I don't know, I'll probably spend about a week on it, because of school at the moment, I, yeah, that's, I'll pretty, I hope they'll spend a week on it. Um, if not, I might be able to get it done sooner if I work full throttle on it, but I've got some got stuff going on this weekend, so I can't completely edit it. Um, but yeah, I'll do a Saturday night uh, editing it. Yeah? Yeah. But anyway, um, uh, yeah. And that's bye from me. And that's bye from me from Project Mojo. Goodbye. <laughs>